So you guys saw I brought him back, yeah? You can't say I didn't bring him back. Uh, someone asked how many likes do I have? Not enough. To quote Matthew McConaughey. Uh, can you hear me? Key numbers. Uh, yeah, we can hear you, definitely. Go right ahead, brother. Okay. Now, so what you're saying is that the, the earliest copy that's still in existence, sorry if you can't, yep. if you can't see me, is from the 3rd or 4th okay. century. Is that what you meant? It's from the 4th century, specifically in the Codex of Codex Sinaiticus. So I'm asking again, are you saying that the, the, one that, the earliest one that's still in existence? Yes, the earliest extant copy of the Greek Septuagint is in Codex Sinaiticus. Extant copy, right. right, right. So I, I, I'm not going to argue with you about whether there were whether that is the earliest copy that's still in existence but mm -hmm. were there earlier copies mm -hmm. that's my question oh yeah 100 percent. yes 100 percent. yes okay so there were earlier copies so so the, the septuagint mm -hmm. was available even before christ do you accept that it's possible but uh, documentary we don't know because the jews tell us that there were multiple streams of the greek septuagint what I would suggest is that there is a work published by Brill called Vitas Testamentum, where they examine the stomata of the Masoret, or sorry, of the Hebrew Bible traditions, and they will clearly tell you that there were multiple streams of what was considered a Greek Septuagint. This culminated in the famous problem, I think it's either John, I know you don't believe in him, but either by John Calvin or by, what's his name, Martin Luther, in which they wrote a treatise mm -hmm. on Paul's quotes of the Greek Septuagint, not matching any of the historical and extant Greek Septuagints in existence. It's one of the most famous problems in textual criticism. Uh, for, for, for the West, that's a problem for the West to contend with for you as um, well. and their innovations. US it's not a problem for me to contend with because our saints quote the Septuagint, our doctors of the church quote the Septuagint, Christ himself read from the Septuagint. We have no doubt in the validity of the Septuagint as the text of the time that Christ himself Brother, read from. You keep saying the Septuagint, but there is no such thing as the Septuagint. There's the Septuagint textual tradition, and if that is the case, you are simply predating it. You don't have a single manuscript except for one of the writings of the patristics, the church fathers, before the Council of Nicaea. Let me tell you exactly which version of the Septuagint we used. Mm -hmm. I have it here Go in right front ahead. of me, actually, translated into English. Mm -hmm. See, we try to make our, our text as accessible as possible. We don't really hide certain things yeah we don't hide you know what I mean? hence we have the kiraat and the musahib thank you the kiraat and the musahib who are they masahib ah, hence, the why, muslims, yeah, hence why the muslims had the science of ilm al rasam al mushaf centuries before the christians but thank you for asking that question so what can you repeat that can you repeat that yeah my muslims my, my arabic isn't for sure. that yeah, so hence Muslims had ilm al rasam al mushaf literally the knowledge, ilm al rasam of the writing, oh, mushaf ilm. of the book, meaning the Quran. Yep. Ilm al mushaf al what, sorry? Ilm al rasam al mushaf. Ilm al rasam al mushaf. Interesting. Um, so the, the version that we use is the LXX Septuagint. You know that makes no sense what you just said. LXX means you don't Septuagint. Know you That's not the name of a manuscript. Oh, so you want me? So you, sorry, so sorry. You want me to bring you the, the the name of the codex, the name of the the manuscript. So when you have a text, right? Um, it must come from mm -hmm. a source, right? What we call the archetypal, mm -hmm. proto archetypal text. Mm -hmm. That's where it comes from. So. For example, when you have the Greek New Testament, it comes from Uncial Codices, and we can identify them. What for? Uh, mm -hmm. What manuscript or what manuscript tradition does your common Greek Septuagint come from? You said you don't hide it; you have it with you in the book. So, what is it? Okay, okay. So you're asking for the Codex. While I look for that, can you quickly tell me what's the? Um, do you still have the original Quran, or is it? I know it, it yeah, was apparently did. an oral tradition. 
So you do have the original Quran? The, yeah, we have we have three documents that you Where can look it? at. The first is yeah, I can tell you. The first is Arabica Mingana one five seven two A. The second is Top Copy, and the third is Top Copy Sarai Medina one A. And uh, we are looking at the terminus uh, post quem the lower limit, uh, where we know that the consonantal skeleton text was actually written. And uh, we can date this using a couple of means. One will be stichometry, where we actually use the science of counting the number of letters per line and the number of lines per page to extrapolate the number of pages within the Musaf copy itself. So thank you for the copy, but uh, thank you for the question, but I think I've answered it. But you did make a claim just uh, now actually, that no, the I'm Bible... Sorry, I'm sorry, I'm sorry. I don't think you have. I don't think you have. Sorry, could uh, you repeat well, that? Well, the scientific yeah, process I'll repeat of counting the number of words... My sentence. Yeah, I'll repeat it when oh, I sorry, finish I my you, sentence. Yeah. Right. The so answer. the claim that you yeah, made was that you that we Muslims hide things and that you don't, and that in the Bible in front of you, you said you had it with you, it tells you what version of the Septuagint you're reading from. So is that still the case, or do you mm -hmm. have to look for it somewhere else? No, no, uh, no, no. I can. I you, I didn't realize you were asking me for what codex um, we were using. But that's. I was always so, speaking about manuscripts. I don't see why that would be different now. I I, you, for a period, we were speaking about versions, and I know you're very good at diverting conversation away from back to the question no, that I will ask again with, about the, the origin of the versions deal with Quran. textual tradition um, and text types. So I was always speaking about okay. the same thing. Codex, One is not the other. codex uh, scenario. Sorry? Yeah, it's not a diversion to speak yeah. about the manuscript. That's what I've been speaking about the entire time. No, no, because I just asked a question about the Quran. But anyway, um, Codex mm -hmm. Vaticanus and Codex Sinaiticus. Yeah, which one do you take the correction against? Codex Alexandrinus is also a later a later version, but That's also includes the text of the two. That's yeah. fifth century. The other two are fourth century. But that's they're they're the, they're the extant copies. They're the currently in existence yeah, copies. But they're not the ones that you of, use in your current Bible today, because what you will either use as are. a dip, brother. Let me finish. Do you use a diplomatic okay. text or a critical text? Uh, could you tell me the difference? I don't. I don't know. A I don't know how to answer that question. Text, a diplomatic text will take the exact text from one manuscript, like Codex Sinaiticus. Or Codex, uh, uh, yep. Codex Alexandrinus, and it reproduces yep, yep, it, yep. and that is what you use in your Bible. Or if it's a critical edition, it collates, so it compares against all the current editions, and then the textual critic reconstructs or creates a prototype text that they think the original no. looks like. So, how do you okay. know which one I can you actually you. use? Mm -hmm. It would be the former, and I can show you why. Um, okay. So, I don't know if you've ever seen one of these. Have you ever seen one of these? Yeah, I have one. Yeah. So what happens is they word for word use the Septuagint, the LXX Septuagint, and then if there are different textual um, ide ideologies, it's under the line. So where the scripture stops, I don't know if you can see that. Let me see. Under yeah, that brother, line, they would make. I, I, I know how I know how this works, brother. So do me a favor. If that is the case, it should tell you what manuscript it takes the main text from. Right, and I I, I did just um, I did just go no, through that. No, no, show me it in the book. The book should tell you it, right? Uh, so, oh, you're saying you're saying yeah. in the book. Okay. Yeah, yeah. I'll have to read the this book. One page, yeah, yeah, the book tells you what the main text is that it takes it from. Uh, so it's called here the Saint Athanasius Academy Septuagint. Yeah, that doesn't tell you the manuscript it's taken from. No, no, that doesn't tell me the manuscript it's taken uh -huh. from. Um, I'm trying to look for the manuscript. When I looked up the um, Saint Athanasius Academy Septuagint, it was mm -hmm. referencing those fourth and fifth century, um, fourth and fifth century manu yeah. manuscripts. I don't know if it's referencing them they're... for the apparatus. I don't know if it's referencing them for the main text. That's for you to tell me. So look at it more closely. For the which one does it say it's for the main? It wouldn't be for the main text. Yeah, it wouldn't be for the main text. Otherwise, yeah, it wouldn't be for the main text. It would be a diplomatic edition. And I know that you don't use a diplomatic edition. No church does. But you can you can look at the book and tell mm. me, and you can prove me wrong live. We ain't, I ain't got nowhere to go, so you know. Do you, so you're, are you telling me that the the answer is here because I, I don't know where I'm looking. I haven't um, really. It's, it's your Bible, brother. You should know where you're looking. Look, look at the start of it. Where does it tell you the main text is from? Why? I'm I've confused. told you where it says the main text is from. You, you're asking a very, okay, very so specific question. Right. 
So show me if, if you say it tells you, then show me where it says it's from. Um, can you say that? No, I can't. But what does it say? Tell us what it says. Read it for us. Yeah, read it for us. I it don't says. Know, read it for us. Okay, so I'll say this again, and I and I know that you're you're starting to hold your criticisms with some sort of arrogance, which I find extremely misplaced. And I can see, I can see the bunch of um, I uh, you know room temperature IQ people in the things acting like you're getting me on this, but I'm just you're asking an extremely specific question, right? Which is I'm asking which codex? The same question. Which, let me repeat myself. Which which. Um, which manuscript you're asking me an extremely specific question which manuscript yes, yes. is this text taken from yes. it says here saint athanasius academy septuagint that's not a manuscript that is no. that is a septuagint when i go through the saint athanasius academy septuagint and i go mm -hmm. on to the the actual website, it's saying that it references the lxx and particularly those codexes that i i spoke to you about so, so are you trying to tell me that because it says exactly I'll, I'll finish um, so, uh -huh. are you telling me that just because it's not on this first page, it somehow is discredited? Or I'm not. I'm, not, I'm actually not understanding brother, what your. I'm saying, um, that your, I'm saying that your claim is discredited because you claim to know where the text came from. Uh, when I asked you where it said that, you said the book. You went to the book. It didn't say that. Then you said the website said that. Then you said the website said it references those texts, but it doesn't tell you how it references them. So, brother, all you're telling me so, is that you don't know the text that it actually comes from, and then you turn around and tell me I'm being arrogant. I gave you the time to finish and look. Look again and tell me when it says it references. What does it mean? Does it references within the main text or the apparatus? Do you know the difference between the main text and the apparatus? Which one does it count for? Yes. So, what does it say? Tell okay, us so, which so, one so, is the main text. Taken from. It, it, do, it doesn't speak of the it doesn't speak of these things this is a study bible it doesn't it doesn't go through the textual integrity of the thing study What's bibles your next will have though? textual critical notes so if your study bible doesn't have textual critical notes they will throw it they away will and get a better one text. yeah no they they do have textual notes throughout the text um right, so then it should tell I can you see what the main text is from so uh, it should tell you go. what the main text is from but I just told you what it is. No, your book should tell you where the main text is from. What is the manuscript it's taken from? It's primary text. Simple question, brother. Okay, here we go. Um, right, I'm reading this page here. Organizing for began replacing. Yeah, yeah, all good. Again, it just mentions Septuagint, LXX. Yeah, so it doesn't want to tell you. Why is that? I'm curious. I'm not sure. I'm, I I don't think it's hiding anything. It's Septuagint, LXX. When I looked that up, it gave me these these codexes. Codex Vaticanus, Codex Sinaiticus. Yeah, what does it tell you? It takes the main text for Codex Sinaiticus, or does it tell you it references it in the apparatus? One is not the same. You've got to be specific in your claim, brother. One is not the same. But you see, I'm not. I'm not really making a claim. You're asking a question, which wasn't what I wanted to discuss. But now I'm trying to answer it for you based on two pages that I'm reading well, as you're brother, asking you, them to me. Brother, you you rolled up here and you made a claim that Muslims hide where their text is from, and I ask you where your text is from, and you're looking up, down, no, 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 yeah, because we have nothing to hide from the Western world. That's all I said. Yeah, we we translate our text yeah, yeah. too. <laughs> what are you talking about? Hold on, guys. We don't we don't translate the text of the Quran. Oh, what is this? An English no, no, no. I've seen the Quran, the Quran translated. I've seen Bro. most of.